I'm an empirical macroeconomist, and in my work, I'm trying to understand what the fundamental economic forces are that cause fluctuations in the data that we observe. Identification of causal effects is um, pretty difficult in macroeconomics because at the aggregate level, everything interacts with everything. So, for example, um, when the Fed sets uh, monetary policy and decides about the interest rate, they're reacting to um, developments in the economy, but at the same time, they are influencing the future course of the economy. And so in my research, I develop um, empirical methods that help us disentangle cause and effect. I'm currently working on developing an energy demand indicator for the U.S. Energy Information Administration. We have a pretty good understanding of the future course of oil prices, also given some of my recent work that uh, developed models for forecasting oil prices. But we don't really have a very good understanding of where demand is headed over the near future. Oil is a very important factor on which the economy is thriving because it's um, an input into a number of industries, but it also plays a big role in the transportation sector and hence it affects um, both households and firms. So when the price of oil moves, then um, that affects the entire economy. Now, especially post-financial crisis, the economy operates in a very different way compared to before. Um, and so we need to rethink and restudy a lot of the aspects of the economy that we took for granted. In the past, usually, oil price increases were followed by recessions. And then once we entered the 2000s, that no longer seemed to be the case. So that told us that uh, probably different forces are at work right now that determine oil prices that don't have such severe economic consequences as a recession. Notre Dame is a really great place um, to be at for my research because there are a lot of colleagues who are interested in similar questions that I'm interested in and whom I can talk to. But I also like the uh, place a lot because of, uh, of the students. So um, they're really uh, great to work with. I have a number of students working as RAs for me. So uh, and they get really excited about the work that I'm doing, which then excites me as well, both working with them and to sharing my experience with them. <laughs>